There are many smart men and women that seek to be president, commander in chief of this great country. All that differs are their motives and their intentions. Many seek the office for personal gain, economic advantage, power, or control. Only one is a patriot. Only one seeks the office to bring about what is best for this country, not for himself or herself. As a veteran, I can say that Donald J. Trump loves this country every bit as much as I do. Trump fights for this country and our freedoms every day. By any measure, Trump is a veteran and my brother in arms. Elect Donald J. Trump as America's president, 2024. And it shall come to pass in the last days, saith God, I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, and your young men shall see visions, and your old men shall dream dreams. Many believe that these days are at hand. On March 25, 1983, Thomas Zimmer, a holy man known as the Hermit of Loretto, prophesied in Rome that Donald J. Trump would bring America back to God. A veteran of World War II, Thomas devoted his life to praying for humanity. Each morning, he gathered the news that day and selected the focus of his prayers for that evening. He attended six to ten masses a day, praying for those he had identified, indicating an awareness of God's intentions for Donald J. Trump. In June of 2020, Archbishop Vigano, the former apostate Nuncia of the United States, wrote a letter to President Trump. Per the request of the former papal representative, Archbishop Vigano's letter to the President Trump has since been made public. It says in part, for the first time the United States has in your president who courageously defends the right to life, who is not ashamed to denounce the persecution of the Christians throughout the world, who speaks of Jesus Christ and the right of citizens to the freedom of worship. Those are prophecies that I don't believe have come true yet. That's why I don't believe that this applies to just 2016. It must also apply to 2024 because certainly there are things here that have not been accomplished yet.